Hey everybody, glad you joined us for the crawfish bowl. Uh, we got about 10 pounds that my son and his friend uh, trapped. They've been, uh, they've been slow this year, but uh, we still got about 10 pounds here to, uh, that we're going to cook up. And right here is the salt water that we're going to purge. We got that in a bucket. We'll pour them off into the, to the bucket. And uh, this is rainwater. We're using salt. Uh, we salted rainwater to purge them. And uh, we got this Louisiana crawfish, shrimp, and crab bowl. That's some of the best stuff around. I do 10 pounds, and we double up on it. And for for this pot right here, there's five gallons of water in here for 10 pounds of crawfish. And see, if we've been stirring in, you can smell it when it's right and tell by the color. See how poor, what a pretty color that is? It almost burns your nose when you get right on top of it. Anyway, we're gonna cook, uh, we got onions and corn and new potatoes. We're gonna cook, we're gonna boil them first and then we're gonna boil these crawfish and uh, we'll put it all in a nice chest. But got my rocket stove going, remember my bayou boiler? I hadn't finished it yet, but I sure have been using it. It'll naturally boil five gallons of fish, or five gallons of water. So we'll get back with you here in just a little bit. Hey everybody, you can see we got us a good fire going right here. The, uh, we got a good fire and got a good boil. We've been boiling this, uh, these potatoes and and corn and onions and we even added a little bit of sausage, smoked sausage in there. It's been boiling for about 15 minutes, so uh, I'm going to call that good. And I'm going to put it in our... I'm going to put it in our ice chest. And then... Uh, We'll get our crawfish in here. Well, you know we had them purging over here. So I'm going to pour this water off. Over here to the side. They've been purging in salt water for about, you know, about 10 minutes. All right. There they are. I've seen some of them big ones in there. They some nice sized crawfish. They're good for eating. All these are were trapped by my son and his uh, friend shotgun. And we appreciate them bringing them over. They're a lot better than them. Uh, these, these are a lot better tasting than the... Uh, there's a big one right there. And uh, now nah, you're missing the painter. Anyway, they're going in the in the bowl. Can you see how it's rolling real good? That's just right for for them crawfish. And we'll leave these in here for about ten minutes. All right. We'll get back with you when they when they all get cooked. All right, we got our crawfish been in here about 10 minutes. We got us a nice rolling boil. They've been boiling like this for 10 minutes, so they're ready to come out of there.
That's not as much a crawl over there as a reward. Let me clip them in here. I wish I had 20 more pounds cooked. Well, we're going to, we got us a crawl dead out, and we're going to show you just how to clean one. Get up close there. You got to get close. Push it in. Push the tail in and then pull it out. But you gotta push it in first. You, and then look there, you paint it off, and it'll come right out of the shell. Man, that looks good. You don't mind if I do? Hey, we'll see you at the tailgate.